I'm Dave. <laughs> oh, I'm Chris. And I'm Kurt. And we're in Nirvana. <laughs> and you're watching Raw Power TV. <laughs> So I want, so the camera's on. So I need you guys to wish um, me a happy Christmas and everyone out there to say to everyone out there, Merry Christmas. You can say that. Okay. Well, so. Let's do a verse of the song. Okay. Uh, Ready? We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Have a Merry Christmas, everybody. And you too, RuPaul. We love RuPaul. What do you want to know? Okay. Eddie speaks. Obvious question right off. What's it like to win one of these things? Oh, I've already got two of them. I have um, three toilets, and I put two of them in each toilet so far, and now I've won a third, so I've That's got American all dream. match. Two three-car garage, too. Yep. That's right. Hey, can I have that cookie, too? Because if we don't come, they won't show our videos on MTV and we'll, our careers will be over. Yeah, you have to schmooze or they'll yeah. you have to kiss butt. We or, a we're here to glad hand. It's not choose or lose, it's schmooze or lose. Schmooze or lose. <laughs> Isn't that true? You know, how important is MTV in determining what not only America, but the rest of the world gets to even hear? What do you think? And that's, that's, a, that's it's a, a monopoly. It's a 99% monopoly. And that's a disturbing paradox between the access MTV has to the people of the world and the potential that it's just uh, pissing away. It's become a, a catalog for like, you know, middle America viewers. They decide that uh, the hot new video is the hot new band of whatever. Uh, yeah. People say that you guys did really well with MTV and MTV exposure. We did fi well financially and, and success wise, but that doesn't mean that we doesn't have anything to do with our music or what we want to say. It's just that we wanted to participate in the music industry, so we participated with MTV. We sold out. Yep. Kill us. Hi, I'm Charles Barkley, host of the season premiere of Silent Light Live with Nirvana. Look, Mom, your favorite, Nirvana. Mm. <laughs> like, here, eat the sweets. <laughs> Come on, Francis, once you do this, you won't ever not want to. Kurt Maker have a little tiny taste. She thinks it's medicine. I know she does. Because it comes from a spoon, right? No, no. That is good. There's no... Mm -hmm. mm. You got That's it now. That's a lot, Kurt. It's a lot. <laughs> hey Chris, are those big bright lights bothering the shit out of you? What? I can't see, goddammit! Mr. Light Person? Miss or Mr. Light Person? Will you turn those big, stupid, bright alien lights off, please? Thank you very much. Thank you. Why don't you like talking about it though? What's what's the problem with 
going on camera and just relating a little story to do with it. Mm. There's nothing to be said. It's all in the music, man. It's all in the music. It's all in the meat. You don't, you don't think that people that are fans of you would like to hear what, what you had in mind, maybe, or what you were... I hear what they have, have in mind, you know, yeah. or like how they interpret said. it. That you so would. Cool. Yeah, but, but I'd, I'd like to get some letters. This is what my analytical uh, my idea personal is, what critique. your lyrics are about, you know. It doesn't matter. Yeah. It doesn't matter, man. You know... you all this is the last song of the evening what is it and this was written by a, what my favorite performer our favorite performer isn't it all of ours do you like him the best oh and there's a donation basket for Kurt wants to buy Lead Belly's guitar and oh yeah this guy representing the Lead Belly estate wants to sell me Lead Belly's guitar for $500,000 Yeah, I even asked David Geff Geffen personally if he'd buy it for me. He wouldn't do it. Okay. I love my sister and I love my mommy too. This song is dedicated to my 12-day-old daughter and my wife. And um. There's been some pretty extreme things written about us, especially my wife, and she thinks everybody hates her now. So, um, this is being recorded, so why don't you give her a message and say, Courtney, we love you. Okay, ready? On the count of three. One, two, three. Okay. Thanks. So I can't say it's too painful. This is too painful. You're gonna make it, man. With the support of his friends and family, he's gonna make it. Some say love 